Hofstra University student Joe Hutter taking Journalism 10, and I got together with a few Hofstra classmates to discuss the presidential debate in 2012 and how it's returning to Hofstra for the second straight time. The first one I missed because I was in high school, so I mean, having it now is awesome. Having it on my birth 21st birthday is even better, so um, for those can those that can't want to come, drinks are on me, obviously. Um, but no, in all seriousness, it's a great, it's a great uh, idea. And I'm really happy that, you know, it's happening here when I can actually go and like watch and report on it. So it's a very good thing. I think it's awesome because Hofstra now becomes only the second school in the United States to ever have two consecutive back-to-back -back debates uh, besides Washington University and St. Louis. It's a great opportunity. It goes to show that we really made an impression on the political community back in 2008 when we hosted the debate between uh, President Obama and John McCain. But uh, I'm kind of upset. I'm graduating in May, so I won't really be around to enjoy it. And the plan is to give a lot of the tickets to current students, let them be the ones asking the question. This is more of a town hall style debate than compared to the ones in the pet, than compared to the last one where it was just you know one moderator taking care of everything. I you know would love to be around, but unfortunately that's not going to be the case. I think it's an awesome opportunity though. I got to attend back in 2008 when it was. President Obama and John McCain's turn, and I really enjoyed myself. It was really just great to be in the middle of a think tank like that. And a great experience for everybody, so I hope that the current students at Hofstra at the time will really get the chance to soak it in and really enjoy some of the events that go on across campus, but for me, that's just going to be another day at work.